Hey, what is up you beautiful people? In this video, I'm going to share with you how to write a proper cold email with follow-ups using ChatGPT. This is something that I did myself and I was mind blown, right? And I'm going to share the entire process with you today, right? So without any further ado, let's get started. So let me just switch up my video and here we go, right? So we have ChatGPT on the screen and I'll just write something like this, you know, right? Uh, uh, cold email to sell my SEO service to, um, I would say my email marketing service to e-commerce stores in US. The email should start with a funny line and also i like i like a funny line i will also write so you have to add all this detail in this thing um the email should have all active voice in first person you must start with a funny line about the industry then write talk about our uh, yesterday uh, yesterday spelling is there we uh, brought in about 50,000 USD for our client uh, I would say XYZ company in the last one month alone the email should conclude with a call to action asking the CEO to book a meeting with us. So this is a prompt that I'm putting in chat GPT. Let's see how it looks. So I will try out of sending emails that end up in the spam folder faster than a sale of Black Friday. <laughs> I love it. Look no further because company uh, are the companies here to stay. This is good. We recently worked with XYZ company. We were able to bring a whopping 50,000 USD in just one month through our email marketing strategies. Imagine what we could do for your e-commerce store. We'd love to sit down with you and discuss how our services can make your email game, uh, take your email game to the next level. Let's schedule a meeting to chat further. I absolutely love it. I'll just use it in the docs. I'll just create a simple Google Talk where I'll paste this email. Right? Oh yeah, I forgot to ask the AI to write some subject lines. Right? Four to five funny and funny and witty subject line with an open loop. Let's see if it, it can understand open loop. I like this one. You won't hit delete on this one. Think your email are the bees knees. <laughs> I like this one. I like this. This one I'll take apart from quick question, which is my favorite. This this looks good. I'll put subject. Or big question or question first name and this is the body the body would read dear ceo are you tired of sending emails that end up in the spam folder faster than a sale of black friday <laughs> this is really really industry relevant look no further because let's say i, I put my company name the track is here to save the day we recently worked with XYZ company and we were able to bring over 50,000 USD in just one month through our email marketing strategies. Imagine what we could do for your e-commerce store. Love to sit down with you and discuss how our services can take your email game to the next level. Let's say you will a meeting. Let me have this week have a quick 
chat. Done. That's the quick question, right? And boom, we are done. Something we can add is this uh, email signature. Right? As funny as hell email signature for the above email. This uh, should be relevant to the e-commerce industry. Any emails that <laughs> oh, I love this. Sending emails are convert like hotcakes at a bakery. <laughs> oh, I love both of these. I'll, I'll put here sincerely. Giant. Making email, e-commerce email marketing look easy, even though it's not, but shh, don't tell anyone. This is fantastic. I would send this to someone. I would send, right? Uh, a five-part follow up sequence of the above email in case we don't get a reply this is this let's see ah oh, this is not funny really This is good. Wow, oh, there is a friendly reminder. I love it, bro. I love it. Wow. See, <laughs> uh, though it's not as funny, uh, make all the above emails a bit funnier and wittier. Oh, just imagine the look on a competitor's faces when they see your sky sales number skyrocketing. <laughs> I love this. Uh, we click on this. If I have a moment, I would love to chat further about our services that can take your email game to the next level. Mm -hmm. We know you are busy saving the world. Oh, I love this. This is great. I just wanted to remind you about the email I sent a few weeks ago regarding this. Mm. Last chance, great. I think it's pretty good. I think, did we hit its limit? But it's not bad. I'll still take it. I'll copy this entire thing and now I'll read follow up emails. So, write a leak last chance email as a follow up to the previous. Old emails, make it funny and witty, and make sure that the person remembers us. <laughs> Let's see. Nice. I like this. So done. So the last one. Boom. But I, you know what? Like the follow up emails are a little bit too long. So I'll put follow one. This will be first follow up. This will be.
then this will be follow three. This will be follow four. And this would be follow five. Beautiful. So let's read all these emails. Follow up one is subject line. Don't miss out uh, on boosting your e-commerce sales and impressing your competitors. There is one follow up I would add. Here I'll be like, hey, see you. I know you're busy with company name. Just following up to see uh, to bump my email to the top of your inbox. Best. This uh, reply for so this follow up mail goes as a reply to that one, and this don't still don't reply. We send this one. Don't miss out on boosting your e-commerce sales and impressing your competitors. This is too long. Mm, wanted to follow up on the email I sent last week about our email marketing services. I know your inbox is probably overflowing, but I really believe you're working with us could make a huge difference for your e-commerce store. Plus, imagine the look on your competitors' faces when they see your sales numbers skyrocketing. <laughs> I absolutely, absolutely love it. If you have a moment, I would love to chat further about how we can help you increase your sales and reach your target audience more effectively through email marketing. Beautiful. A quick update on email marketing services. Here we can add a second case study. Mm, imagine what you could do for e-commerce. It's like hiring a superhero. But without the spandex, <laughs> I love this. I love this. I would add that as a subject line. It's like hiring a superhero, but without the spandex. Just a friendly reminder. Uh, I think I would add this as a question. Be saving the world. Have a track record of success, blah blah blah. If you have a moment, I'll have to chat more about it. One more time for the road because they're persistent, not creepy. We have had grades. I don't like this one. I don't even that should be given, not saying this out loud that we are not creepy it makes us creepy. So let's skip that. Uh one more email to see if you'll be interested. Great successes. Never hurts to have a backup plan just in case your current email marketing strategy is as successful as ball pit as a toddler's birthday party. <laughs> wow, beautiful. If you have a moment, I would love to chat further about how we can help you increase your sales and reach your target audience more effectively through email marketing. Follow five, one last chance to boost your e-commerce sales. You won't regret it. I hope this email finds you well. Mm, one last follow up regarding our email marketing. So I know you are you short a few times already, but I really believe that working with Pixel Track could make a huge difference for your e-commerce store. I have a track record of success and I have recently bought 50, this is one more case study, so case 33. There was one case study here, so you might need three case studies for this. That's right. If you have a moment, I would love to chat. Don't miss out on the opportunity to take your email again. Don't wanna be that guy. I don't know, thinking about it. But yeah, a great email with subject lines, good body, great, great signature. I love the signature and five follow-ups done right here, right? This is absolutely crazy that AI can do. I love the emails, dude. This AI wrote a joke, no joke, right? So, I mean, you tell me what you think about this and... Let me know in the comments if you would be using ChatGPT to write your cold emails. And if you want to learn more on how to use cold emails to get booked meetings after booked meetings and everything, then there is a link in my description and the comment where I have a 30-day sequence on high ticket selling. It starts with prospecting and ends with closing both. So go ahead and subscribe there and let me know how it goes. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. Do leave a comment. Do subscribe if you like this channel. Bye-bye.